Hey guys, welcome back. Now, in this lesson, we would like to create a game where you are this player right here, and the goal is to collect all the garbage. So, collect the garbage, the garbage should be inside this bin, and uh, if you collect all the garbage, then you are the winner. So, let's start right now. Uh, first of all, I would like to program this player so that uh, so that he can move upside, downside, or to the right, to the left. Uh, so, first of all, I would like to start by clicking to the flag. So, when the flag is clicked, then go go to where it is right now. So, go to X, as you can see right here, minus 164 and Y, 65. So, when a uh, flag is clicked, the player should go right here. But if uh, the right arrow is clicked, then I would like to change the X by 10. So, change X by 10. I will duplicate it and I will change it to left arrow. Change X by minus 10. I will duplicate it again and I will use the up arrow but this time I don't want X. I would like to change Y by 10 and I will duplicate it again and change Y by <coughs> minus 10. So now it's okay. Uh, I will start by clicking the flag and as you can see I can change Okay, I forgot this one. Change up arrow. And when down arrow key is pressed, I would like to change Y by 10, as you can see. So it's okay. I will go back to garbage one. I will take one of these right here. And I will also program it so that when the flag is clicked, I would like to go where it is right now. So motion, go to X and Y. You will see that automatically it takes the dimensions where it is right now. So X is minus 70 and Y is minus 146. So when the flag is clicked, it should go right here. And then it should repeat it should repeat until until it touches it touches the player so it should move uh it should move for one second glide one second okay I will uh, I will try this and then I will copy this I will duplicate this but I actually will take off this and use only this and then I will I will try to I will click it right now to see what I have done until now so this is a very random uh, 
a very random movement. What we can do actually is actually sex to oh, glide one second to uh, not random position but uh, to say where it should go. It should go glide one second to x minus 200 zero to minus 76 and then glide one second to where it is right now so glide one second to minus 70 and to minus 146 <clears throat> so if I try right now you will see that there is a more smooth movement between right here okay so it should move all the way but I would like I would like to do when actually the player touches this garbage it should go inside right here so it should go to 170 and minus 104 and 4 right here so I will click it right now I will duplicate now I will drag it and drop it to garbage 2 and then I will do the same for garbage 3 and then I will do the same for garbage 4 and then I will do the same for garbage 5 the only difference is that I would like to garbage 2 to change it change minus 70 to minus 150 two times right here is the second one and the y to minus 63 and garbage 3 is to 20 and minus 114 to 20 and minus to 114 go to garbage 4 garbage 4 minus 54 to minus 70 minus 54 to minus 70 and finally garbage 5 is minus 167 minus 167 to minus 153 minus 167 to minus 153 so let's start right now Okay. Okay. Here it is, but I need the event. Where is the event? Okay. The event, the event, the event, the event. And here, when flag is clicked. So let's see. So, one last. Okay, what, what? Okay, now it is finished. So, when you get all, you can click here, stop all and actually you can create uh, another sprite that it says you won maybe 
have something bigger. U1 and when you can also change okay and actually when the flag is clicked it should be not shown it should be uh, actually hidden so I will click hide and when this is this right click I can broadcast a message so a message you won and this you won should be shown when when I receive you won then it should be shown of course you can also change where you would like to go uh, maybe it's not very nice very uh, that they go to the same exact place so you can change where they would like to move inside your bits and I can actually I can try to take all the garbage right here Maybe I should change the touching player and I should uh, change it to maybe to the color of the player. Okay. Now it's okay. So click here. So I have an error right here. I do not need this stop all because I need to broadcast you won and then you want to be shown. So now uh, after collecting all these garbage, I will, uh, I in the screen will be shown the you, sh the you won message. So this is a very simple game. Of course, you can change it. You can add points. You can change the behavior how all these garbages are shown and moved in your screen and um, I think it is a very good environmental game <laughs> okay so I'm looking forward to seeing you in the next lesson with the next game